so hi everyone today we will be demonstrating how you can build a graph rack system using llama 3.1 so basically in this tutorial we will be creating a graph rack system using lang chain and would be using the llama 3.1 8b model for, as an llm so let's get started so first of all i'm in, in, installing lang chain experimental community the basic lang chain lang chain core and lang chain grok so to get started, you first need to create your Grok API key that I've already covered in the previous video, how you can do it. So do check that out. Once done, the rest of the code remains very similar to what we have done in the previous section also. On graph rack, you need to import LLM graph transformer, graph QA chain, network X entity graph, etc. So first of all, you need to create your LLM object using chat Grok. So here you need to pass the entity the id of the model that is llama 3.18b instant even the 70b model is free not the 405b model but i just tested it out the performance for 8b model is comparatively better than 70b in this particular use case hence i'm using 8b but you can check out the official growth page to how to use a 70b model as well and provide your growth api key here once done you would be providing a text over which you wish to have the graph rag create documents create the LM graph transformer object and call convert to graph documents. I have already explained this, that's, that is I'm just running through it. Once you have created the knowledge graph, the knowledge graph gets created here. You need to add the knowledge graph into graph nodes. As you can see, I'm adding the graph nodes into network X entity graph. Once done, you need to create a graph QA chain over the graph object that you have created. So first of all, you're creating a knowledge graph, then a graph object. And then third, you are calling a graph QHA. Once I will be showing you the results for the mod knowledge graph generated, the results aren't great because it is able to identify just three relationships. So in the previous tutorial, if you will check, I use the Gemini API by Google. It was able to identify about 20 to 25 relationships. So I think in that case, Gemini was better. Llama 3.1, but it is a 8B model. Even the 70B model didn't give me great results. So I think... That is, a, this is the max I can get from the 8B or the 70B model. Nonetheless, the code is working. Results aren't great for the knowledge graph because if the knowledge graph is not great, I think your retrieval QA chain will also won't be giving you the best answers. Nonetheless, I asked it a question. Who is Shalini Shukla from the context? So it is able to wrap everything that uh, was present in the knowledge graph created. But the knowledge graph created was quite poor, I would say. So not very happy with the performance of Llama 3.18b model and even the 70b model to be frank because it was able to extract just one relationship. So I think I might be missing out on something or the LLM is not suitable for graph rack I would say. Thank you so much. So hi everyone, graph rack crash course is out now which includes all the codes, a theory ebook and link to the video tutorials. So check out the link for the course in the description below. Thank you.